So I will start with the mobile glitch application explanation. So in this page, we can create our account as usual. We can if we forgot our password, we can reset it by our email. For example, we'll use the same email at the first demonstration when we click reset. So an an email link will be sent to the email. And here is the reset link. We can reset to a new password. Lah. So let's say the password is not going to be for account. And then we click save. And then the password is resetted. We can log in with our new password. Then click sign in. And then we just log in into the application. Then we can change our name. Example, we just put Kamil. Then we click update. And then we can change our phone number. For example, zero one two five four five four one seven eight. Then we can also we can change uh, the password inside the application after we log into the application. For example, we create a new password called. Test one two three and then test. If not, ah, uh, if the password do not match, it will be the error lah. One two three. And click submit. The password already changed. And then we log out. We log in again with our change password. Click sign in and we just log into the system. User as car as uh, this talk we toggle to the car section car display and it will display the car we can change out we can update our car for example for so just like that change back to five update we can delete it uh, let's say we want to edit a new car one six eight update. So let's say if the car status is unpaid. So if the car status is unpaid, they cannot uh what you call it. They cannot the the application um prevent user from deleting the car when the status is unpaid. The status is unpaid, and user need to log in. Yeah, uh, they need user need to pay for the parking service charge but, but they accidentally click update uh delete and this application prevent from from the action lah. so that's all for me thank you very much about the application